Hello everyone. Till now we have implemented the abstract model for our pipeline. Now let us start implementing these stages in the pipeline script. Before moving to that, I want to highlight one more thing. That is from the Jenkins itself you can generate the pipeline script or pipeline syntax. For that use this option that is pipeline syntax. So here using the snippet generator you can generate the script for the steps and using the declarative directive generator you can generate the directive for the stages. So for example if I want to generate the script that will clean up the workspace from the drop down select clean WS and click on generate pipeline script. So this is the script which I need to use in a step in order to do the cleanup of workspace. And this script is written using the pipeline syntax so that's why I don't need to use the bat command along with this script. In the similar manner if I want to generate the snippet for declarative directive just use this option. So in a pipeline script except this step everything is considered as a declarative directive. So for example, if I want to generate a declarative directive for the agents, so I will select the agent and here I will select agent run on any agent and click on generate declarative directive. So this is the directive I need to use in my pipeline script. Okay, so I'm going to use this script in the first stage of our pipeline. So as I mentioned earlier, this is written using the pipeline syntax, so we don't need to use the bat command. So in the second stage, I need to do a checkout from the git. So first I will go to the git repository to get the clone link. So this is the link for cloning. And here I will select checkout, specify the repository URL. Okay, we are getting the error. So to solve this error, just go to Manage Jenkins, Global Tool Configuration. So let me open this location. Okay, I think I need to specify the executable also. And click on Save. So just close this and open it again. Check out. Repository URL. So now we are not getting the error. And click on generate pipeline script. So this is the script which we need to use. So I'm going to use that script in our second stage that is git checkout. And save it. After that, I'm going to build it. So let me open the console. So you can see here this is coming from the cleanup script. And you can see here this is coming from our checkout script. So it cloned the entire directory from the remote repository. Now this is a location where it cloned. So let me open this location. So this is the content. 